Hello, I'm Gwen Malbeck, I'm the CEO of FreightPath, and I want to welcome today, welcome you to this demonstration of the FreightPath software. Um, we know that small carriers and the motor carriers across North America have trouble in getting organized with their paperwork and streamlining the communication with their customers, whether they're shippers or brokers, and be able like, to scale up and to perform and do more loads uh, on a daily basis with the same stuff and, and still getting organized. So today I'm going to guide you through how FreightPath is going to help your small transportation company in uh, communicating, sharing and dispatching information about your day-to-day -day activities. Obviously, your operations are running today and whether you're working uh, with an Excel, with an Excel spreadsheet or you already have made some investment into a, an old and outdated TMS, we want to show you that there's an alternative way, a way for you to be more structured, more organized and have the right information popping up to you uh, uh, when you need to. So what I'm showing you today right now is the uh, Freight path shipment list. This list allows you to have in one central location all the information and all the shipments you're currently dealing with or have been dealing with in the past couple of days. It's very easy for you now to access the right information uh, based on like your specific needs, whether you have a shipment ID that you want to retrieve, whether you have a specific customer and a specific shipment status that you want to have access to. We have a set of filters that have been defined and that are laying here on top of the shipment list that will allow you to filter and access the information in a heartbeat. Um, you can see that I can uh, navigate through like, my different shipments and access more information on each and every of these shipments at any time. So, for example, here I'm interested in all the shipments that are going to be in transit for specific uh, customers of mine. So I see that this customer with that shipment status, when I enter those filters, four results are coming back and I can see like, them all on that one page. Simply by clicking on the line, I can access like the more detailed view of that very shipment. I can see where the truck is in real time. I can have access to all of like, the uh, manisha and all the information on that specific shipments uh, in a what we call digital bill of lading view. We have also a lot of documentation that we're generating, but we're going to save that for later as there's uh, uh, enough content to talk about just document on its own. Um, you have a set of actions as well. So your product, your freight path software will help you in taking all the required action that you need on that specific shipment. Whether it's updating your customers, whether it's updating the location, whether it's changing the status or editing it, like all those actions are going to be made available for you at this stage. So not only FreightPath allows you to have this one centralized way and view to access all your shipments like in real time, we also allow you um, to deal with your entire network uh, within the system. So we have a special tab for it on the uh, left hand side of our menu. And what you can see here is those, those three streams and those, those three pillars that are constituting your business. Your business is all about your customers, about your drivers, and maybe uh, in some situation, some partner carriers. The beauty of freight path is the, the ability you're going to have to consolidate and to uh, carry all those network and all those information within one centralized place and make sense of all of that. So for your customers, for example, you can start with um, creating them editing them and having access to all the historical information for all those customers and what you did for them as shipments uh, but also like all the locations that uh, those, uh, those uh, customers are usually shipping from or delivering to um, so you can again keep track in a consolidated like, uh, uh, way all this information in one roof you also have access to all your drivers and all your assets. So you are able to basically uh, carry the list of all your drivers and allow for uh, direct communication with them uh, at all time. 
And finally, I was mentioning your um, partner carriers. Uh, we are able to allow you, we are allowing you to uh, maintain their uh, documentation and insurance uh, as well as like their uh, carrier packets that you can also easily share with your uh, end customers uh, for sake of transparency. Uh, so again, all the information that is required for you to do your business efficiently on a day-to-day -day basis is regrouped into that network tab that allows you again to keep yourself organized and more efficient. Uh, finally, we uh, also have a way to get you highly organized by allowing you to not only get information sitting within FreightPath, but to extract the information that is relevant to you and your operations. Whether you're looking at uh, creating a driver pay report or a uh, sales team commission report, or whether it's just like a shipment report of any kind, or a customer report on all the shipments you've been doing for a specific customer, our powerful yet flexible uh, um, reporting tab on the left hand side of FreightPath would allow you to generate and customize any type of report you want to better just, uh, uh, deal with your operations and get yourself once again organized. So you are probably wondering how does that actually work? How do you create a shipment? How do you dispatch it easily to your drivers? Well, let me show you that. So what I'd like to do is, should you have, you know, reoccurring uh, shipments, shipments that are happening on a, a daily or maybe weekly basis, you can just access uh, one of the past shipments you did and easily duplicate it. So it really saves a lot of time. It really allows you to just create a shipment within literally seconds. So once you realize that all the information is um, good and that um, corresponds to what you want to accomplish here, you select the dates, you select uh, origin, the destination, you really type the instructions uh, that you want to share with your drivers, the equipment type, the type of commodities, the locations, uh, origin, uh, destination, any uh, special instruction in, in terms of the handling uh, of the shipment as well uh, can be entered here and communicated easily to your driver. So you can see here that I can uh, decide to dispatch to my driver that I'm selecting here by the way, I also have like a calendar view that I can uh, make sure there's no a existing conflict with uh, my driver's schedule. And once I confirm the driver, I can go ahead and simply book the shipment. What I want to show you is how easily um, you can dispatch to your drivers uh, this, this shipment. So I just created the shipment here and I just received it as if I was the driver onto my cell phone. So as a driver, I can know what is my next appointment? What is my next assignment? Uh, what are the driver's instructions? If I need to bring special type of equipment, uh, I know where to pick up from and where to deliver. I know all the contacts uh, that I need to uh, keep in mind if I need to call someone for my pickup or my delivery. Uh, I know pretty much everything and everything I need to know about that specific shipment is being communicated to me in a click of a button. The beauty of that and that um, mobile dispatch to your driver as well is you can use either a tablet in your truck's cockpit, you can use like, the uh, driver's existing cell phone and smartphone and your driver will be able to report back and forth to you with no touch of their, um, of their phone all the relevant information so that you can be aware of everything that is happening with your customer's shipment at all times. So you're allowing your driver to accept or decline a the shipment. They can review their payment details uh, out there. Uh, again, everything they need to know like, to, to do the job you expect them to do. Uh, you can also track in real time your um, a driver's phone so that you know exactly where they're at. And again, you can let your customers know about all of this. Uh, so you'll see that working in a mobile dispatch way uh, and being able to share back and forth this information with your customers is going to tremendously accelerate uh, the, the way you're doing business and how organized things are in terms of uh, uh, this streamlined and seamless communication. So I mentioned this in the intro of that video, but one of the biggest aspects uh, and how FreightPath can help you succeed and grow your business and is, is in getting organized with your documentations. 
By documentation, I mean your bill of lading, the proof of delivery, uh, the rate confirmation that freight path can help you automate and generate on your behalf. So when you're using freight path and you're creating a new shipment, you have two options. You have one option, which is to generate your own uh, custom BOL with your text, with your legal text, with your logo, with your name of your company. Or you can also leverage the broker or the shipper's uh, BOL and upload it into the system and allow yourself to use this as a point of reference to create your shipment and to track everything that happens with that with that specific load. Um, where FreightPath really helps you in that collaboration, communication aspect of things and for you to retrieve your proof of delivery once a shipment has been uh, accomplished and once you want to start just getting your invoice to the door, uh, this is where FreightPath really helps as well. We have that technology that your drivers are able to use the driver app uh, that they're using to be tracked to also upload pictures of the shipment at the origin, at the pickup location, or at the delivery location to really uh, allow you with uh, to get organized for everything around claims. But we also allow you to collect um, digital signatures from the shippers, from the driver, and as well from the consignee, so that the documents that you're using within FreightPath, whether it's been auto-generated or you've been uploading it, can get attach all these digital signatures and your team and your admin team and your dispatchers were are able like, to uh, generate the invoice and send the invoice in a heartbeat uh, to the customers. So here is another way for you to be really well organized, accelerate the efficiency of your, uh, of your business and uh, being able like, to provide a higher quality service to your customers. But hold on a second, the true value of freight path lies into how we ease communication with everyone in your network. We've seen how you can easily have all your shipments in one place, how you can easily dispatch that information to your drivers, but now you have centralized into your freight path environment all the information that you need to report to your customers uh, on their specific shipments. So this is why I'm going to show you how you can now access any shipment from your shipment list. Click on the action button and add access to the shareable link. And you'll see how easy this is because at the end of the day, they don't need, your customers don't need to have any credentials, they don't need to remember anything, they just access the link you're providing them with and they can access, again, real-time information on their shipment. And by the way, the information they have access to at this point is the information only them should have access to, which means the security of the data is respected. That means just like you're not sharing this uh, relevant information on your accounting, for example, with your customers. You're only sharing what your customers is supposed to be looking at. What does that allow you to do as a business owner of a small uh, carrier company? That allows you to streamline uh, the status call and check calls you're going to have your, with your customers and act and approach the shipment with an exception-based management. If everything goes well, don't need to touch anything. Don't need to call back and forth your customers because they will be made aware of everything that happens. Should something uh, arise, then you'll be made aware and you can take specific actions within the system. You can then go ahead and edit the shipment uh, and everyone in your network will be made aware of those changes as well so that they know exactly what happens uh, at every single second with the shipment that you're dealing with. We also have sections here where you can share additional documents should you go through uh, uh, international uh, shipments, uh, cross-border shipments. Uh, you can add any specific documents that fits uh, the reality of, of this existing shipments and being able to be more uh, collaborative to that aspect. So again, not only FreightPath helps you in organizing, structuring, streamlining your activities, but we also allow you to provide a way better customer support and customer service by again sharing all the relevant information in real time with your customers. This is what we call transparency at FreightPath. I want to thank you for taking the time to watch that video. Um, if you need any more information on FreightPath, visit our website at www.freightpath.io. 
uh, you can reach out to me at any time as well. It will be my pleasure to answer any request of yours at gwen at freightpad.io. And uh, we're looking forward to uh, partnering with you and helping you grow and organize your carrier business. Have a wonderful day and see you next.